Zodiac BFFs. It's me, Godiva Empress, and welcome back. So we're gonna get straight into it. 2023 has been a year full of drama. And unfortunately, a lot of the Virgo celebrities were in the headlines. So let's talk about it. Now, first of all, let me give this disclaimer really quickly, really quickly, really quickly, really quickly. My loyalty lies with Virgos because I am a Virgo. So understand that. I will say I'm not completely happy with everything that these celebrity Virgos did in 2023, but I'm gonna stick beside them. Well, here are a few of the celebrity Virgos who made the news. And I'm gonna tell you what they did right and what I didn't really care for. Let's start off with the good. So Beyonce, yes, the queen bee. She did her Renaissance tour. Beyonce, you delivered. Delivered. I heard it was great. I've been to one of Beyonce's concerts before, so I didn't really have to go again, and I didn't really care for Renaissance. Y'all know this. I'm glad it did whatever she wanted it to do. Of course, undeniable, Beyonce is one of the best performers and entertainers of my lifetime. Queen B. Good job. Good job. And if the goal in life is to evolve with your talent, your gift, your skill, your niche. She did that. She switched it up. It wasn't a switch up that I cared for, but everybody lived. And the girls, honey, they came out, okay? They had all the silver on. I've never seen so much silver in my life. I didn't even want to eat off of silverware after I saw all of the silver. There was a lot. They looked fab, delicious. Y'all looked amazing. Oh, I was here for the outfits, honey. I was here for the outfit. You know I like a little extraness, and y'all was extra, extra. Shout out to the Beehive, cause y'all did that. Now I will say when she did her premiere for the Renaissance movie thingy or whatever, that I definitely would, I'm not attending uh, a movie about a concert that they showed all over YouTube for free. But for the ones who supported, she needed y'all, so. She thanks you. I'm sure she does. I'm thanking you for her, even though I'm sure she did. But y'all, anyway. To the movie premiere, I saw a picture where she had silver, okay? The dress was cute, nothing fabulous. Just a, you know, a, a thin strap, silver, shiny, disco ball looking dress. I will tell you who did slay though, Kelly Slade. Did you see her silver? Now she slayed. Get back to Beyonce. So she just had on a nice little cute basic dress that probably cost $5 million. And then she came out with the new blonde hair. Okay, so here's my take on the blonde hair. Um, I liked it because it's different and we're tired of seeing the honey blonde highlight, blah, blah, blah. So I liked it because it's different. She did seem a little pale. She still looked good, but she looked very pale. And I personally like the thicker Beyonce. I don't really like the slim Beyonce. But most importantly, she does. Anyway, we're starting off with the good. So Beyonce, good job to a great Renaissance tour. You did that. You had the girls out, honey. You had them out, girl. Okay, and on to the next Virgo who made 2023 jump. Jada Pinkett Smith. <clears throat> Again, this is no secret. Everybody knows me and Jada Pinkett share a birthday, September 18th. Yes, that is my birthday twin. Jada has made it very difficult for us to be loyal with her. You know Jada has made the headlines plenty of times for various things. My girl, she does a lot, but this last time she made headlines because she made a book. I told y'all I was gonna get the book, but I did not get the book because she told everything that was in the book. So I didn't see the point of buying the book. So she kind of messed that up for me. Jada, I don't know. Uh, again, I'm not denouncing you. I support you. And yes, I know y'all don't come in my comment section. I told you I'm a Virgo too. And I know Will is not perfect. We know that. Will is not perfect. He just does not air everything out. And Jada, that is why I am disappointed in you. Because why are you telling all your business? Where is the Virgo in you that's going to say, Shh. girl, won't tell all our business? You, uh. so that is the problem I have with Jada. Because you, girl, you're spilling all the tea. And ain't nobody asked for none. Get us free. Take us out the group chat. So yeah, Jada made a tell-all book about her and Will's relationship and how they really weren't married at the time of the slap and something about Tupac and I, I don't know. I don't know. 
it's just too much. It's just too much. Please take us out the group chat. We want out. We don't want to hear nothing else. It is hard for us to keep supporting this, this back and forth. I feel like you are really thinking out loud and living out loud and got too much life that you shouldn't be showing out loud, out loud. It's enough. Just, just let it die down. I think y'all need to kind of live in private at this point, you know? Mm hmm Just keep it in the house. Whatever y'all do. Because nobody, nobody wants to see it anymore. Yeah. Everybody is over it. it it's not exciting. Uh, nothing is new. Um, it's taking y'all down a few notches, you know? You know how... Do, do, do. How you supposed to go up? Y'all going... Do, do. Doom. Like you're going down, you know. Um, so for 2023, I'm disappointed. I still love you and consider you a Virgo sister, but baby, you have really made and Jada, we share a damn birthday. So you know, you have really put me under scrutiny. I don't like that. I don't like that. Because I'm not doing what you're doing. Now, I didn't been toxic in my day. Let's be very clear. And it's probably some underlying of toxicity that they can always come out. However, I ain't never did no husband like this, Jada. But then again, well, what have you done? Hmm? But the thing is this. Will was quiet. He didn't make a blue table and tell his business. You had to have a red table, Jada. Next! Kiki Palmer, yes, okay. She's another Virgo. Now y'all know I have been a fan of Kiki Palmer. I love Kiki Palmer and I still love Kiki Palmer. I just don't. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Let's talk about the good first, okay? I think she did a fabulous job hosting, what did she host? The Soul Train Awards? The Soul Train Awards. Great job, she did a great job. She even performed. I will say the performance did not have me as empathetic as I needed to be. Because I am disappointed in the fact that there was physical abuse in the relationship. And so what I heard a couple days ago, y'all are rekindling things. Again, Virgos know if there's a possibility that you may be with that person, why are you going to tell the world the negative stuff? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. She didn't tell us now. Okay. In her defense, Kiki did not tell us her business. She filed a restraining order, I believe, and it became public, um, the evidence. So, okay, I, okay. Virgo man, Virgo woman, I do not condone domestic violence, physical abuse, verbal abuse. I don't condone. I am the Virgo. I am currently in a relationship. I've never dealt with physical or verbal, well, verbal maybe. It can happen to anybody. It's never happened to me. But if it does, I'm going live. Ain't no hot nothing. Because for me, because there's other people out there, I'm probably gonna move the hell on. I've moved on for way less, is what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm just, I'm very surprised that the, the even, going back to Jada, they said even Will might have uh, put his hands on her. I hope not. Why is it so acceptable for physical abuse? Yeah, I'm not with it. And for the ones who are watching, I've been and you just never know. You don't ever know. But I'm not gonna pretend like it ain't happening. For what? I can't get help that way. Back to Kiki Palmer. I think Kiki Palmer is a beautiful girl. I think she does a fabulous job at being who she is. She is just somebody that we see as strong, as strength, as being transparent when it comes to helping other people. So, I was just kind of feeling a way about her transparency through the whole situation, I was surprised. A little disappointed, but I still love her. I am not the happiest that she's going back to someone that her mom clearly said was abusive like his brother. Again, it's not my relationship, but I am entitled to my opinion and I'm not a fan of him. Doesn't matter, cause I ain't effing him. I still don't like him though. And, and whatever. And the last Virgo who made the headlines of 2023 and wrapped 2023 all the way up with a big bang, pop, sizzle, smack, thump, crash, 
Fire, burn, burn, burn. It's Cassie. Yes, Cassie is a Virgo. Cassie is Diddy's ex. I don't know if it was ex-fiance, ex-girlfriend of 10 years. Well, Cassie shut 2023 down, did she not? This one right here, Cassie gets. Okay, she gets all the claps because she started something that should have been exposed. And you know how bold she had to be. You know how much research, you know how much homework she had to do. You know how much studying and making, you know how strategic she had to be? Because she was. Don't get it twisted. Cassie is the Virgo MVP of the year. Out of all of that I named, she's the one. She came out and said her truth. And the only reason why she hit it and I understand hers is because we know Diddy has all the power in the world. We know that. We know Diddy has all the power. It's no secret he doesn't always use it for good. Cassie was bold enough to tell her story to get other women comfortable to tell their story. We know he's a billionaire, but she was the start of the hole in them pockets. And now, the allegations just trickling on in. She moved on, she got married, she had two kids, and yeah. Virgos can lay low. We can try and put effort to lay low. It doesn't always happen. Some kind of way we end up in something that ends up being larger than life. Like Beyonce, Jada, Kiki Palmer, and Cassie. We definitely had the headlines jumping in 2023. There's no doubt about that. Say we didn't. Say we didn't. All 2023, y'all have Virgos names in y'all mouth. And some of y'all didn't even know these people were Virgos. And they are. Virgos are undeniably and will continue to be the best zodiac sign of the zodiacs. Do Virgos always make the wisest decisions? No, we don't. We're the closest thing to perfection, but we're not perfect. So to all my Virgos, keep striving to be the best version of yourself. But yeah. Let's not pretend happiness. Let's not fake happiness though. Bye y'all. Love y'all. Peace.